Hey guys, how you all doing? You're back with me, Dazza, and today on Dazza Does, we'll be trying um, something I've never, I don't think I've ever seen this before. I don't think so, anyway. Uh, and the reason I actually found this was because I was looking for the white Teddy Chocolate Orange, but this is actually the dark one, the dark chocolate. Um, I was at the shop, it was at the end of last week, my local shop, and the woman who works in there said she isn't a fan of this chocolate orange because it tastes like orange oil, um, which... I guess it would, you know what I mean? It does say the top, made with real orange oil. Real orange oil. So I don't know if you can get fake real I mean, so, um, so I've never, ever, ever, I don't think I've even seen that before. I did, let alone, I definitely tried it, because I remember that. Uh, if you ask a good lady, she will tell you, she will testify on my behalf that I am a sucker for a Terry chocolate orange. I also thought I'd be able to beat the world record for eating a Terry chocolate orange as fast as I could. I think the, the record's like just over a minute. Uh, I got maybe 30 seconds and I had one bit of it. There's 20 segments to that uh, chocolate orange and there's always 20 segments to it. Uh, so, seeing this, my curiosity got the better of me and I thought, right, let's have a go. So I think it was a squid. One pound for a B&M. B&M, uh, yet again, the, the, the hardest shop I've ever been in my life. Uh, and the, uh, we were in it on, what day was it? One day at the weekend and it was quite quiet for the B&M we, we, we go to. Uh, and every five seconds, boop, tannoy. Somebody, chill, till two, till three, cancel that, da, 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 da. And they've got all their Christmas stock in, they've got Halloween stuff in. It's unreal, but yeah, people are buying it. We even went into B&M uh, a couple of months ago. So what was that? Where, where are we in now? September. Just say June, it was summer, and they had Christmas stuff on clearance from last year. But tell you what, there'll be somebody out there, right, and goes in and a fiver comes out with a shitload of stuff. And that's them sorry for this year's decorations, they are absolutely geniuses. Guys, before we kick off with this, Terry's Chocolate Orange. Um, I keep telling people on my comments, uh, they, if, they, if they recommend something or suggest something for me to try, I keep getting texts, um, they'll say, oh try this, try that, try this, and I say to you, I'll put it on the list. Now, that is my list. I don't know if you, my, my writing's absolutely atrocious, but I've got the writing of a three year old, right? But it says product to try, and I've got all oh, the ones that I've tried to scribble out, and the ones I've yet to get there. So, that one there, says Tenant Super Lager for you, Gordy. So, it's still on the cards, mate. I'm I'm confident I'm going to get one pretty soon, because I know where to source it, I think. So, we've got a lot a lot of things to come up, and there's things coming out, and yada yada yada. So, bit of a busy schedule. So, we'll just crack on this Terry Chocolate Orange. So, it comes in a... Well, cardboard container with plastic wrapping. Um, but there we go. 157 grams. Why it's 157? I will never know. Oh, so I've opened the bottom, the, the top and the bottoms came out of it. Its arse has collapsed. Pardon me. So, get that away. Now, I don't know how you all do that, right? But I take that, and you won't be able to see it, but I'll do it in my little hands. Tell you that elbow will be dangerous in the UFC. So, that's me now smashed up my segments, I think, if I've done it properly. Oh, it's very dark. Did it smells like dark chocolate? Look at that. So that's your in fact. There's only me eating it, so there we go. God say it looks like a cricket ball, doesn't it? A fucking burnt cricket ball. Um so that's our Terry Chocolate Orange, and believe me, you me, there are 20 segments to it. I've counted them numerous times. So I'm not a, a huge, huge, huge fan of uh, dark chocolate, and the missus absolutely hates it. But um I thought I'd give it a go because I love Terry's chocolate orange, the normal one. So, as, you can, as you can see, it is very dark. It smells like Bourneville chocolate with a hint of orange to it. Give it a wee taste. Um, strong. Very strong. I always find as well, dark chocolate is a lot more dry than um, milk chocolate, plain chocolate, right? whatever you call it, normal chocolate. Um, I can never tell which one's, I, I know you get white chocolate, but it's plain chocolate and milk chocolate the same thing, because I don't have a clue, and my always laughs at me for it. Um, with this dark chocolate orange, uh, you can't really taste a lot of the orange in it compared to the normal one. The other one you can just taste orange from start to finish. And normally what I do is I put it in my mouth and it melt. But I got a feeling that it will take a long time with that. It's quite dry. Um, very, it's almost, pl uh, 
tastes like plastic or fake chocolate. Um, so, sorry, fucking dry. Uh, out of 10 for me, it's going to get a 4. I was expecting a bit better, the, the orange isn't there. The orange could be a bit more stronger, but it's just lacking for me. The chocolate itself tastes fake, it tastes like plastic, like cheap chocolate. No offence, Terry's, whoever, you, what company is it anyway? Is it just Terry's, are they like, whatever, right? Um, if that was a normal to chocolate orange, it's 10 out of 10 for me. That one was a bit of a letdown, I won't lie to you guys. But see if you want to go out and get it. Go to B&M, it's on, it's on, uh, don't think it's on deal, I think it's a price, one pound. Uh, give it a wee go and see what you think. You might think it's the best thing since sliced bread for yourself, but for me, it's a miss. Uh, would I have it again? I wouldn't, I would stick to my um, original Terry's chocolate orange. But I will say, I have seen or I was tagged in on Facebook by the good lady. Uh, oh by the way, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, uh, do -do 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 -do. Facebook. I'll put the stuff below later on, and I'm very eager to try this white chocolate orange, but I can't seem to find it anywhere, I know. So when that comes out, we'll do a video on that, but until then, you have to deal with me, listen to me dealing with this plasticky chocolate. Uh, so out of 10, I say 4, wouldn't have it again. What do you guys think? Leave some comments below, please, guys. Thank you very much, and have a swell day. Cheerio!